I really think this can work. Oh, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Bananas and scallops. Talk to me with the salsa. What's going on there? We've got roasted corn, avocado, and papaya, lightly dressed with lime juice, a bit of cilantro, and salt and pepper. Visual impact. Yeah, it looks amazing. The hidden secret is this sauteed banana underneath. You'll each have to prepare, cook, and present one extraordinary dish using only the ingredients hidden under the boxes in front of you. We'll taste the top three dishes, and the cook with the best dish will get a critical advantage in the next challenge. It's time for a new challenge, and of course, it's going to be the mystery box that I hate and that hates me. On the count of three, lift your boxes. One. I don't like to see a piece of seafood underneath the mystery box. Two. I'd love to see a tuna steak in there. I am really hoping that there's like flour and sugar and dark chocolate. I can do dessert. Three. Oh. 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 Wow. <laughs> I'm not quite sure what these shells are. It's obviously a shellfish. I open up the box and I'm staring down at these three huge scallops. Scallops. You've got the most amazing hand dive scallops. Delicious arugula. Bananas, fresh avocado, eggs, cauliflower, corn on the cob, shell peas, pancetta, croissant, and finally, brandy. Winning this mystery box challenge comes with a huge advantage. Are you ready? Yes, yes chef. chef. 60 minutes, starting from now. I won the last two mystery boxes, so it would be awesome to 3 P. but I take every challenge that it's back at square one. I love to cook scallops, but I've never shocked a scallop before. I do not know what I'm doing. I'm operating on instinct right now. Just wrong on so many levels. <laughs> You're a little bastard, aren't you? <laughs> Beautiful. These are the nine best amateur cooks in America. If they give a seared scallop with fruit salad on top, I'm going to throw it back in their faces. What would you be doing? What would you make? I would do a corn puree okay. and roast the scallops and do a little sort of light reduction from the fish. For me, those hand dyed scallops, you can eat them raw. Yeah. They're that good. Yeah, it's like candy. They're so sugary, too. And pull the banana. Be the curveball. Immediately, I am obsessed with this idea of pairing bananas and scallops. Never thought about it before, but can't get it out of my mind now. Oh! oh. I really think this can work. Oh, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. 45 minutes to go. Right, Christine, what are you cooking? Um, I'm thinking, um, 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 have a little, um, maybe grilled corn and beans scattered around with a little fish stock. Great. All right, guys, less than 30 minutes to go. So, Ben Starr, why would you start for the first time ever trying to roast a banana and put it with roasted scallops? I think he's out of his mind. Christian's wrapping the scallops with a pancetta. So, to get a perfect sear on that, it's very tricky. I'd rather you sear them first. Just kiss it on either side, yeah. sear it, and then wrap it in the pancetta and roast it all out. Yeah. Tricky. It's very tricky. Go. These are perfectly fresh, delicate scallops if you overcook them. I must admit, a little stress. 60 seconds to go! One of you is going to gain a major advantage in the next stage of this competition. 10, 9, 8, 7, that we are dying to taste. The idea behind this dish is so out there. It's so bizarre, you just can't resist it. Ben Starr, let's go. <laughs> it's not a trick. <laughs> right? It's not a trick? <laughs> wow. Bananas and scallops. Talk to me with the salsa. What's going on there? We've got roasted corn, avocado, and papaya, lightly dressed with lime juice, a bit of cilantro, and salt and pepper. Visual. Impact. Yeah, it looks amazing. 
The hidden secret is this sautéed banana underneath. It's got that nice crisp caramelization, but it's still slightly pink in the center, which is really good. It's not perfect. However, you took a huge risk, and it worked, because it is delicious. I mean, really delicious. Thank you so much, Chef. Amazing cookery. It works beautifully. Good job. Thank you so much. It's OK. It's not terrible. But I think I would have to commend you for uh, a risk probably pretty well taken. Stunning dishes. Was it the risky fried banana? Anything I can do to save myself from elimination is crucial. I really want it. Or was it the complex scallop three ways? It's going to be between me and Adrian. Or was it a single attempt at one scallop cooked beautifully? If Christian wins another fish thing, I'm going to just. Ah. The winner of the best dish belongs to.